Master's Team class, take one. You guys knew that I had to do that at least once. <laughs> the little amusements that keep the day going. All right, let's get started. Competition. Everybody bow, seat, feet crossed, eyes closed, get yourselves relaxed, ready to go. Two. 
Down and up, 14. Down and up, 15. Down and up, 16. Down and up, 17. Down and up, 18. Down and up, 19. Down and up, 20. Down and up, 21. Down and up, 22. Down and up, 23. Down and up, 24. Down and up, 25. Down and up, 26. Down and up, 27. Down and up, 28. Down and up, 29. Down and up, 30. Down and up, 31. Down and up, 32. Down and up, 33. Down and up, 34. Down and up, 35. Down and up, 36. Down and up, 37. Down and up, 38. Down and up, 39. Down and up, 40. Good. Sit up. Last set. Right side. Last one. Let's go, guys. We're slacking off. No matter what. Join me. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, one, two, three, four, and five, and six, seven, and eight, and nine, and thirty, one, and two, three, and four, five, and six, seven, and eight, and nine, and forty, one, and two, three, and four, five, and six, seven, and eight, and nine, and fifty, cross line, one, and two, three, and four, five, and six, seven, and eight, and nine, and sixty, one, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, and eight, and nine, and seven, and one, and two, three, and four, five, and six, and seven, and eight, and nine, and eighty, one, and two, three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and nine, and ninety, one, and two, three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and nine. Honey, stop now, jumps. If you have a padded surface, rod, carpet, whatever, do them on your thrust punches. If you don't have a padded surface, you're on a hardwood floor, suck it up, man! I'm Don't do them on your thrust punches. Do regulars. But you guys can on your thrust punches. Ready? You have a surface. Ready? And one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Are you guys? Jack knives. Ready? Count after me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Good. Stand up. Right in place. I know. We didn't do this yesterday. Ready? When I say move, say your stance. Two front knuckle punches in front of you. I say go, turn yourselves around. Two front knuckle punches behind you. Make sure you guys have space, you're not going to hit anything or anyone. Ready? Move! I want to those key eyes, let's go! Move! Why can't I not hear you? Move! Go! Aisa! Move! Aisa!
jump around a little bit. Combination two, go! Ready, back up. Combination two again, go! Eight up. Combination 18. Go! Back up. Combination 18 again. Go! Eight up. Back up. Keep running. Hands up on guard. Moves. Eight up. Make sure you're still awake. Make sure you're still alert. Go! Eight up. Move. Eight up. All right, walk it down. Front position. And breathe out. The seat on the floor for a butterfly stretch. Excuse me. Water. See, the nice thing is you guys probably can keep the water right next to you at home. And I would never know. Drumming class is okay. Can you get a drink? No, it's about 45 minutes without water. And, what's up, Master Scene? How's everybody doing? Hope y'all are doing well during these times. I hope a lot of you guys have chimed in to train. If you're not all streaming media content on your mobile devices and just only watching cartoons. Make sure you're getting some training time in. Stretch towards your right. So they like it. All right, you got the same sort of uh, assignment that you get black belt. Basically, from 
rain belt down. Actually, no, you know what we'll do at the end. So from this, we look down. So overhead knife, side plug one, straight knife, and overhead plug. Your homework is to go over both lefties and righties for overhead knife, overhead plug one, straight knife one, and side plug. That's your homework. Doing those, doing those four techniques, righty and left.
advanced pheromones, guess what? Double it up. So, you ranks that have not been to the out of class test, that have not felt the pain and the torture and the torment that we put you through for your brown and advanced brown and black belts, you only have to do one set. The rest of you, double it up. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ready? Kick. If you want to grab like something, a crutch, whatever it is, uh, go for it. But just try it. Ready? One hook. Ready? Chamber up. Pivot all the way around. Snap it out with your heel. Rechamber. Down and back. Move! Thank you. 
Going over. All right. New green belts and advanced green belts. You have your homework. We're gonna run through straight knife number two and side club number two for the majority of you guys. Um, you've all learned it, so take it upon yourself to use the guidebook, use the website, and review those on your own. I'm gonna jump in with the brown and advanced brown belts today, and we'll kind of trade off between classes. So I just can't get to everything. It's in, it's not really physically feasible. So, <clears throat> straight net two and cycle two. Start with cycle two. Remember, stop the club before it gets past their shoulder. So, for side club, the arm is stopping their arm. Your, your block is stopping the attack kind of like from hitting in the base. But the real thing that's stopping their power is that forearm smash through the ribs. So, as they swing in, sort of block, forearm smash through the ribs at the same time. Grab the wrist, outward elbow. I don't let go. I cannot stress that ever enough. Step back in the side horse stance with your left foot. Hold that arm straight. Rise and form into the just above the elbow. Reach over, grab the club. Side kick to the ribs. Pull the club out, step down. Smack him in the head. Went over this on the YouTube videos and the Facebook videos that we uploaded from last week. So I'm just doing a quick run through again. Okay, side foot two, lunge in. Sort of block, forearm smash, grab, outward elbow, holding on, holding on straight, rise the forearm, reach over, grab the club, side kick to the ribs, pull the club out, hit to the head, cross and cover, letting go of their wrist. Now straight neck number two. Knife comes in, heel step back, cross palm, sword hand block, pull in, rising forearm into just above the elbow again. Actually, no, sorry, uh, just at the wrist, or just at the forearm. It's more of a guard than anything. So strike into the rising form into the arm. Side kick to the back of the knee. Step down. Half moon around. Hip in their shoulder. Palm to the back of the head. Slide up. Press through a safe neck. All right. So green belts, advanced green belts. Go over those. Advanced brown belts, brown belts, and etc. What do you guys? You guys need a straightening knife. Now, yeah. I know I have to refer to a sheet. What? Gutting knife, ooh, yeah, let's do gutting knife. All right, yeah, gutting knife. Same rules apply to side club three, or sorry, side club, uh, side club one and two. You need to stop them before they get past their leg. So, if they swing in, lunge in with your left, downward X block, block the arm, block the wrist, right hand on top, left hand underneath, because this is important for the setup. Grab the wrist, flip your left hand over so your thumbs are pointing the same direction. Shuffle back, turn your thumbs up towards the ceiling, Press the wrist down to loose up the grip, grip and fold them down. Instep kick to the face, step forward, fold the arm into your belly, put their arm behind their back, crush the wrist to break the grip, take the knife away, and push. So let's do that again. Lunge in, downward X block, right hand flips over so your thumb is down, left hand also flips over so your palms are together and your thumb is down. Twist their hand, shuffle them back, crush the wrist. Front hand set kick to the face, fold the arm behind their back, collapse the wrist, take the knife away, and push. So that's straight neck, that's cutting knife one. Straight knife three, same idea, going the other direction. Cutting knife goes to the outside, straight knife three goes to the inside. Lunge in with your left, parry block with your left hand, reach over with your right, so this time right is on top, actually no same idea. So again, left on bottom, right on top, reach over, left. Half moon back, same exact ending. Inverted wrist lock, holding their body down, front set kick to the face, fold their arm in, take the knife away, and push. Now for you brown belts, do that righty, do that lefty. Advanced green belts, do your knife defenses as well. Straighten knife two, and side club two, and overhead club two, and all of your weapon defenses. Do them both righty and lefty. You guys, gotta get, you guys want to get ready and start preparing for that test coming up in June. So, keep at it. Lastly, advanced brown belts. Let's do, yeah, side, uh, back slash and neck one. And again, you gotta remember, the person's swinging across and then back this way. <clears throat> so as they swing in, around, your goal is to fade back with your left, cat stance with your right. As they're coming back, you're lunging in, stopping them before they get past their shoulder. So lunging in, double sword hand blocks, you grab the wrist, and you're going to get your wrist underneath that point in their elbow, rolling them down to the floor as 
as you shuffle forward, throwing them to the floor, throwing them to the floor. Make sure that you avoid swinging there because their hand's coming out this way and the hand has a knife. Avoid swinging, hitting your uh, striking your own leg. So get your leg out of the way, hold the wrist, get the arm behind their back, invert the wrist lock, press the wrist, and take the knife. Let's do that one more time. Head comes in, we lunge back into our right pack stance, lunge forward into our right half moon stance, sword hand block at both the wrist and the elbow, just above the elbow, grab the wrist, shuffle forward, fold them down to the ground. Fold the knife around their back, inverted wrist lock, crush the wrist, take the knife. So, it is on you guys, go over your weapon defenses. If you really want to have fun, have your parents uh, grab you in your grab defenses as well. You guys can do a sort of makeshift circle of death with your parents grabbing you in one of the conventional ones. Front choke, front lapel, front wrist grab, uh, front bear hug. Do not toss your parents to the floor, right? It is only if they want to participate. If they don't want to participate, don't make them. But you guys can definitely go over those grab defenses to the end. All right? So, that's all the time we got. It's on you guys to keep working on your skills. Make sense? Cool beans. From position, feet get on lift. Way back, seat, feet crossed, eyes closed, relax. Back's nice and straight, heads up. Cut.